Many people have theorized about how to win a stirring contest. The most people have um, agreed on is that you have to keep your eyes moist. Now, many people have theorized on how to do this. Some say that you should moisten them beforehand, which I agree with. How to try and cry. Now, that would work for many people, but some people it is very difficult to cry. You could also make yourself, um, you could also blink a lot, which would trigger a reaction from trying to, your brain thinking something would be wrong and trying to get something out of your eye, which is most notable I try to do when they blink. Winning a stirring contest not only depends on your eye moistening, but also depends on how long you can keep your eyes open. Most people think that you should keep your eyes completely open. I believe that you should keep your eyes partially open. That way you retain more moisture, which is very key when trying to when at a stress. Once you have done all these things, it should be very easy for you to win a staring contest. Although you should not make it so noticeable that you are doing these things, so your competitors do not get ideas to try and mimic you. Speaking of your competitors, do not try and show off with these things. If you do do it once, you should not. Playing dead can be really fun sometimes if you do it right. Most of the time, in most plays, you will die falling down, either because you get shot, you get stabbed, or multiple many reasons. You'll probably fall down. Now, if you fall down, you probably want to fall to the side where you hit your thigh or your butt because that's where your most the most padding is. And playing dead, you kind of want to look like a possum if you've ever seen that where they like they see you and they play dead and like fall over and whatever. Well, they do that because they don't want to hurt. And you can do that if like a bear's trying to kill you, like you just play dead and it'll leave and it's awesome. But um if you're if you die in a bed, you can just close your eyes and, not, and you don't make yourself look like you're breathing, which is pretty easy because you can breathe from like side to side instead of up and down. And um, it's awesome because you need to feel that character and feel like if they got shot, let's say, in the stomach, what would they do? Would they kind of hold it and fall backwards or would they just get shot and fall probably something you need to look up probably figure out their character and you need to figure out where which way you would fall you want to figure you don't want to fall forward if you got hit from the front you won't probably want to fall backwards and if you get hit from the side you probably want to fall sideways and if you die in a bed like i said just do whatever most comfortable as long as you don't blink. Some people die with their eyes open. And if you can keep your eyes open when you die, I mean, I applaud you for that because I can't. My eyes get super dry. So, and, lions um, are very big. They have huge jaws that will eat you in, say, about five seconds, maybe? Maybe. Maybe. You'll have to look that up. I don't know. But lions are very good at eating people, very good at eating stuff, very good at eating anything, really. But you can't give them scrap metal or anything like that. You have to give them whatever you want to give them, except for scrap metal, because that's bad for them, or whatever. <laughs> so, lions are huge. They like to eat and sleep. That's mostly what they do. Or they like to roar in your face because they are scary, and I don't like them. Well, 
not that much. Um, so lions, they love, love eating. But you don't want to be their meal. You really don't. They have big teeth that will eat you. Very huge teeth that will eat you. Very, very big teeth that will eat you. And they like to eat you. So stay away from them. They are lions. You don't want to get eat my lions. That is the worst way to get eaten. You get eaten by anything else, but not lions. Because lions are yucky and gross. Well, sometimes they're gross, because I don't know. Um, so lions. Yes, yes, lions. So they like to sleep and eat. Wait, there is. Well, lions, there is, there is, um, big lions, small lions, baby lions, all kinds of lions. But lions, they like to eat you. Most of all, they love to eat you. And they will try to eat you if you get too close to them, because they don't like humans. They will try to eat you if they get a chance, but don't let them get that chance, and then they won't eat you, which will be good, because you don't want to get eaten by them at all. What do you want to go eat? Okay. Where do you want to go, though? Why are you yelling? What kind of food do you want? Why Whatever. are you yelling? How about tacos? Bye by me. Okay. All right. Where do you want to go get tacos? Like Taco Bell? Okay. Or Whatever. How about tacos for life? Okay. Bye by me. What do you want to get there? Mm, whatever, I guess. How about a carne asada? Why are you yelling? How about a fried chicken taco? Why are you yelling? How how about some uh, nachos? What Why are you yelling? How about Korean barbecue. Mm, whatever. All right. Okay. Let's get in the car and go in order, okay? Okay. And by me. All right. I guess and scene. <coughs> Do you want to go make a puppet show? Sure. Let's go. I want to do it at the library. There are lots of people there. Sure. All right. So, come on, let's go use my car. Sure. Well, let's get going. No, thanks. Why not? We're gonna put on a puppet show at the library. Let's go. All right, I got a little confused there. Sure. All right, well, let's go. How could you? What, what did I do? I was peacefully going to the library with you guys. Sure. But I'm telling the truth. You do realize that, right? 
No, thanks. How could you? Why are you all turning against me? Isn't this a nice thing we're doing? Sure. No, you know, I'll go put on the puppet show myself. I don't need you. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. How could you? <laughs> what am I doing wrong? Okay. Whether you like it or not, let's go in the library and put on the puppet show. Now let's go. <laughs> sure. Guys. Guys, let's go to that scary cave. Are you talking to me? Yes, I'm talking to you. Andrew, you have to say a line. Say a line. I don't necessarily have to. Yeah. Okay. But let's go. Stop. Why? You said we could. You said. I said let's go. Talking to me. Sorry. 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 Hey, you heard about that guy, Charlie? I heard he never showers. Hmm. Good point. I heard that he, yeah, he farted on the hamburgers last week when I had lunch. It was disgusting. I heard that he never eats anything that hasn't been spoiled. Yeah, well, I heard something that I would not believe. He went to the moon, and and he he went up there while he was sick, and he let the sickness into space. And I got really, really mad. I heard that he um, committed the first crime on um, uh, the moon. Here comes Charlie. Oh no. Hey guys! Hey, do you want to eat some of my spoiled food I have for lunch today? Here it is. I want my mommy. Oh yeah! Can someone call the police? I and I don't want this guy near me. No, I want to have lunch with you today. He's not giving me any personal space. I want to have lunch with you today, okay? Chloe, help me. I can't. I have to go. You is some of my beautiful spoiled food. Come Get on, me out of here. Eat it. Eat it. Get us out of here. Why do you want to eat my beautiful yeah, spoiled we'll food? Your this guy won't give me any personal space. Please come help me. Oh, here comes Charlie. I heard he's lived in Australia for a long time, and he has an Australian accent. I heard that Charlie had really bad hair days. I heard that he only likes to eat Italian food. I heard that he only likes to eat Taco Bell. I heard that he loves to swim. I heard that he hates basketball. I heard that he's partially blind. I heard that because he's partially blind, he has to use a cane. I heard that he likes to work out. I heard he only does it once a week. I heard that one time he took this kid and he, well, got in a fight and he lost. I heard that he absolutely hates daycares. Here comes Charlie. Good day, mate. How about some Italian food, eh? Oh, hey, Charlie. Oh, um, hey, we just kind of ate lunch. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, well, you know, we just 
came from lunch. We're now we're yeah, just we just um, came from eating burritos. Um, help me out. Um, we just uh, um, heading to the pool. Yeah, we were just heading to the pool. Oh, I love swimming. Oh, um, actually, um, um, I just realized I have a dentist appointment. And I have a phobia today. of water. Yeah. Um, very serious case. I guess I'll go work out then. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 you, uh, yeah, you do that. Um, uh, bye, Charlie. Uh, bye. Bye. Talk about Charlie. <laughs> yeah. Did you know that he only changes his bed once a year? His bedding once a year. He only changes his bedding once a year. I heard he only wears his pajamas. Well, he never, ever, ever changes his clothes. All he wears is the eat, same pajamas. I've seen him eat food off the floor. Did you know that he shaved his head yesterday? I heard he calls he calls the minions from the minions from the Despicable Me movies. My friend said he once wore a pink coat in his hair. Here comes Charlie. Hello, everybody. Hey, Charlie. Hi, Charlie. Do you want to eat a snack with me today? No, thanks. Here's I some have food. A, I have a buddy. It's really yummy. No, thank you. Oh, yeah. You asked me to take off my clothes. I'm not going to do it. Cause this is the only clothes I own. Cause I am so poor. I only have about one dollar in my bank account, and that is why I need to eat my food off of the road and the floor and just anywhere I can find it. So I keep buying it at a store. Step right up, step right up. Who wants to become a part of the Lion's Gate trick? Oh, oh, me, I do. I want to. Step right up, come on. <laughs> okay, so what do we do? Yeah. All you have to do is step in the cage. Okay, sounds simple enough. And all I have to do is lock it. Um, why? Why, and why is it moving? Why are we going up? Um. Oh, yeah, I forgot that part. Well, you see, the cage is kind of lowering into a pit of lions. <laughs> mm, they look hungry. They haven't, they haven't been, they haven't eaten for three months. Three months? How are they not dead? Mm. But how do we get out? We're not part of this trick. Well... Since I'm not totally evil, I give you a couple of items to use. Um, oh, here's a bobby pin? Hey, I saw a movie once where they took one of these and they unlocked the cage. By any chance, oh, by do the way. I... Oh. Well, yeah. Your... yeah. Pockets. That's how much time you have left before the cage bottom drops. We have three fall. minutes left. Yep, good luck. Okay. Um, how, okay, how do you let's try to know? use the bobby pin and pick the lock, I guess. Okay, I don't know how to do that. You try it. Okay. Here. I got it! Oh, right, okay. Go. Um, but that's like 20 feet above ground. Well, it's better breaking our legs and dying, I guess. Yeah, that is true. Okay. Here Three, I go. Two. Two. One, jump!
Hey! We made it! Oh, that could have been very bad. Yep. Oh, you know what? I'm retiring. See ya. Should we call the cops or? Nah, she's not smart enough to hurt anybody. I guess. And see. Him. Call the oh, team. We're on the oh, same oh, shit. Oh, what are we gonna do? Call the have any ideas? Go oh. tips. It's a great idea. What? What are we gonna do now? I don't want to die. Wait. Man. I don't want to jump off the ship. No, just jump it off. No. 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 Drive. Drive. What are we gonna do now? Just wait. I, I don't. Chloe. I don't know. Wait until someone comes or something. Okay. Okay. Great idea. Let's do that. All right. One week later. <clears throat> Chloe, I think we're gonna die of hunger. We've been too long without food. <laughs> And ah, oh, this is such a nice cruise. Whoa! Oh, did we hit something? I think There's we something. did. Ah! Water! Water! No, water! Not water! Ew! Water! Or whatever. Uh. Uh. It's kind of getting higher. What's Jump! Twenty. <laughs> 30 minutes later. <coughs> what are we doing here? I don't know. Uh, I found some logs. Man, so hot out here. Uh, how do we get out of here? Mm. Hey, here are some logs. I guess we could use them. But how we attach them into a boat? Now we can see the hole. Yeah, now, now we make, now we make the boat. Uh, okay. Yeah. 20 minutes later, our boat's finished. <laughs> but I'm hungry now. I see some food over on that island. Maybe we can paddle there. Yeah, there's some fruit. Come on, let's go. Do, 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 do. Ah, fruit. Yum. Mmm. And okay. see. Okay, so the drop-off point for the secret, um, package will be at the old mill. You got it? You got it? Yes, I got it. Okay, so you're going to have to go over there. Be very careful. Things can be overheard. Know that. We have to be very quiet when doing it. You should have been quiet. Things were overheard and I got your message. I'll be waiting for you at the plant. No. How could yeah. you? Man, this is the best way to spend a Friday night. Hanging out with friends, take out on Japanese food, and also binge watching movies. <laughs> These noodles are delicious. Yeah. This Chinese food is really good. But I call the I call the fortune cookie. Fine, you can Whatever. have it. At least tell us what it says. Yeah. The laziest man makes the least mistakes. Um, that is the stupidest well. fortune cookie I've ever heard. Those don't even come true. You never know. Yeah, right. Anyway, can you hand me some salt from my popcorn breeder?
Yeah, you know, last year, whatever. Hold on. Here. What's wrong? What? This is sugar, not salt. Oh. Okay, so what? She grabbed the wrong one. It's not like that fortune's true. Yeah, I mean, they look so similar. Yeah. Salt now? Sure. Here's the salt. Okay, what movie do we want to watch? Hmm. Sandlot. I want to watch the Sandlot. Okay, but I'm only going to rent it because it's not like I'm ever going to watch it again. Nope. Okay. Oh, Can no. What oh, great. I accidentally bought what? it for $30. What? Whatever. Wow. A movie that I'm never going to watch again in my life. I bought it. Mm. Hey, Marie, can you make some hot cocoa? Why can't Miley? You can do it this time. Fine, I'll go make it. Okay, here it is. There you go. Man, I think this works. Thanks. No problem. <coughs> What's wrong? You put chili water, not not hot cocoa. It's what? Straight up chili water. It's chili water. Okay, Ew. whatever. But that let's fortune just, isn't true. Yeah, it is. I, let's just watch the movie that we're never gonna watch in a million years. And scene. Our, our Chinese food is on the way. Yeah. Bing. Oh, that must be the Chinese food. Hey, mm. my Chinese food, please. Let's eat. 30 minutes later. I'm full. That was good. It was. Now it's time to cookies. open our fortune cookies. Yeah, you go first. Mine says good things are going to happen to you in the future. Mine says a message is on the way. Ah! Message in a bottle. Of course, I didn't notice that. It says I want a free ice cream cone. Let's go. Yep. Let's go get your ice cream. Yum. And scene. Okay, the kids are about to get home from summer camp, and you need to work on your jokes. Why don't you tell me a few and see if they're good or not? Okay, um, how about this one? What did the baby corn say to the mama corn? I don't know what. Where's popcorn? Uh, it's funny, but not the best you could do. Did you hear that? I did hear something. It's probably just the air conditioning or something. Don't worry about it. Um, okay, let me try another one. Um, when does a joke become a dad joke? When? When it's a parent. <laughs> okay, I heard it that time. Um, hello? Okay, tell another joke, but listen. Um, okay, why do people in the desert never star? Why? Because all of the sand, which is there. <laughs> okay, it's coming from the closet. You go look. That, someone else is here. Okay, you go look. I'm not going to go look. Um. Hello? Anybody here? Who the are you? Um, oh my goodness, who are you? Um, I'm the Um, hello? 911? There's a strange person hiding in our closet and laughed at the jokes. I don't know who she is, but can you come get her? She's, yeah, this is weird. Please. Okay, they're on their Bye. way. Bye. What? Hey, get back here. I don't know what just happened. I don't know. Yeah. 
Um, okay, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Let's just go to bed. We got to pick up the kids tomorrow. Yep. And see. Would you like to pay with cra- cash or credit card? Credit card, please. Huh. This looks like my old credit card. Oh, what a coincidence. Wait. This is my credit card number. No. <laughs> yes, police? Somebody stole my credit card. I kind of got to go. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> Take her away. Uh, Take her away, me, boys. Me. Get her in jail. I will be back. I will be back. Hello. I am here with the local news where we have the biggest heist in the town. I have found the criminal. Wait, wait, can we get an interview with you, please? Oh, yes, that's why I robbed the bank so I could be on the news. Thank you. So, what would I need to say? Why? What? Why? Why did you do this? So I could be on the news. I made it so obvious with my mask and my money bag so I could be on the news. That's the only reason? You didn't want the money. No, not the money. Money I'm gonna burn in my stove, okay? But the fame. Nothing. Just the fame. Yeah, of course. What are you gonna say, Mr. Policeman? You may just need to be on the news. You still need to be arrested. Yeah, whatever. It's just a day or so. I'll be fine. Actually, you're going to go to prison for life. Well, the state is and he could pay. Let's see how he will do in a couple of years. What? Goodbye, stay oh, safe. Great. Have a great night. Dang it. I thought this would be a great idea. End scene.